come on an adventure with me. Come on, let's read a story. <laughs> Children in Need, The Lost Bandana. Choose Read to Me to hear the story read to you, or choose Read by Myself to read the story with a grown-up, a friend, or by yourself. Pudsey had lost his special spotty bandana. He was wearing his plain one instead. It's not as nice as my spotty one, he said sadly. Pudsey's spotty bandana was precious because all the spots reminded him of all the children that children in need have helped. Where's it gone, he wondered. Tap on Pudsey to see what he is thinking. Maybe I left it with one of my CBeebies friends. Pudsey decided to go out and search for his bandana. Pudsey arrived at the Scarlet Squid. Hi, Jem, said Pudsey. Hi, Pudsey, replied Jem. Can you help me out? I'm mopping the messy deck at the Scarlet Squid before the swashbucklers arrive. Can you help Jem and Pudsey mop the deck too? Thanks, Pudsey, said Jem. Is there anything I can help you with? I've lost my spotty bandana. Have you seen it? asked Pudsey. I'm sorry, I haven't, replied Jem. But I do have this pirate bandana. Maybe you can wear it instead. Thanks, Jem, said Pudsey. Pudsey liked the pirate bandana, but he still wanted to find his spotty one. He decided to keep searching. Hi Andy, said Pudsey. Hi Pudsey, said Andy. Can you help me please? I've dug up these dinosaur bones and need to put them back together. Can you help Andy and Pudsey put the bones back together? Thanks for helping, said Andy. Is there anything I can help you with? Have you seen my spotty bandana? asked Pudsey. Jem gave me this pirate bandana to wear, but I still need to find it. I'm sorry, I haven't, replied Andy. Why not wear this dinosaur bandana instead? Thanks, Andy, said Pudsey. Even though he liked the dinosaur one, Pudsey still wanted to find his special spotty bandana. Pudsey arrived at the Furchester Hotel. Hi Phoebe and Elmo, said Pudsey. Hi Pudsey, said Elmo. Can you help Elmo and Phoebe out please by putting these hotel keys back on the right key hooks? That's great. That's right, well done. That's right, well done. Thanks, Pudsey, said Phoebe. Is there anything we can help you with? Have you seen my spotty bandana? Asked Pudsey. Andy gave me this dinosaur one to wear, but I still need to find it. No, Elmo hasn't. But Elmo does have this pink furry bandana. Maybe Pudsey can wear it instead. Thanks, Elmo, said Pudsey. Even though he liked the pink furry one, Pudsey still wanted to find his special spotty bandana. Maybe I can help you find it, Pudsey, said a voice. It was Mr. Tumble. Oh, hello. Swipe the screen to see what is inside Mr. Tumble's spotty bag. The tumble tap helps people find things, said Mr. Tumble. Can you tap on the green spot? Well done. But that's my bedroom, exclaimed a confused Pudsey. Then that's where your spotty bandana must be, said Mr. Tumble. Thanks, 
thanks, Mr. Tumble, said Pudsey as he rushed home to his bedroom. Can you help Pudsey search for his spotty bandana? Well done! My spotty bandana! exclaimed Pudsey happily. It was hidden under my pillow all along. Pudsey was so tired after his long day searching and helping his CBeebies friends that he lay down and fell asleep. Still wearing his spotty bandana. Can you help tuck Pudsey into bed? Thank you, whispered Pudsey. <laughs>